Well, in other news this morning, if you're a little sad that Christmas will be over in just a few days, how about taking a little trip up to the North Pole and then living there? Yeah, and then living there, actually <laughs> buying this right now on Zillow, the home of Santa and Mrs. Claus, along with several tiny elf homes is posted for sale. The property is 25 acres. It includes a state of the art toy making facility, a garage space big enough for eight reindeer. Rare. This is real. It's on <laughs> Zillow now. The estimated worth of the homes in the land is just over $1 million. I do feel like we do need to say, though, Santa Claus is not leaving the North Pole. He's probably no. just, you know, upgrading. Well, yeah, maybe he needs a bigger toy facility. Yeah. I, you know, I would buy that, stick my kids in those tiny homes, get a little privacy in the main home. Yeah, right. It's perfect. Each have their own house. Make toys. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> That's what you're there for. So yeah. You have an extra reindeer, you got enough room. <laughs> <laughs> Turn into Mrs. Claus and then. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, you have have just about a week to get your 2022 New Year's resolutions ready, but many Americans are not planning to have one this year. I haven't thought of one yet. We'll figure it out. We got time. A new study found about 44% of people actually plan to make resolutions. That's down from 50% a year ago. And therapists say skipping resolutions can actually be a good thing, saying that pressure to make big changes can be bad for our mental health. But we said earlier, it's just a good time to reset. Well, you no. know what? Okay, let me just say this. If you know that you're you have a problem with resolutions, if you know that like you feel bad about yourself if you end your resolution in February, just don't make one. Then don't make one. Don't make one. But if it's something that motivates you for the new year, then make one. Like, yeah. And if you don't stick to it, like it's not the end of the world. There's no steadfast rules on a resolution. No. You do what you do. Exactly. You do you. Do you. <laughs> All yeah, right. with that advice, Becca. And that's the little pep <laughs> talk I get every morning in the dressing room from Abby. Good morning, everybody. You're out the door.